Hello again, everybody. It's Scott Hudgens here with Dodd RV. Today, we're looking at a brand new 2024 Thor Chateau 24F. Large, single slide out, queen bed on the slide, Ford V8 chassis, gas motorhome. You got the bunk over the cab, generator. Let's get started. Take a look. Hey guys, remember watch all the way to the end of the video. I'll show you a clip of the slide in so you can see what you do and don't have access to when you're in travel. Remember, give me a quick thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, hit that bell. That'll give you a notification every time I put a new camper on. So be the first one to see new floor plans, options, decors. Make sure you hit that bell. Check down in the description. I have all your specs, holding tank sizes and measurements. And remember, if you're coming out to the lot to see this or any other camper in person, make sure you ask for Scott. All right, stand at the entry door looking in. Got your one full length slide out. We're looking at the Aspen gray interior with the coastline gray cabinetry. Queen bed on the slide. Got the bunk over the cab. That's where we'll start. Your TV does swing out. You got a curtain that closes off the bunk area. Two curtains that meet in the middle. You get good privacy there. And then there's another curtain that closes off the cab area when you're parked. Your bunk area has got its own AC ducts, roof vent, cup holders, little storage area here. You got an 800 pound rating up here on these bunks. You got a hard bottom on this, a ladder that hooks right here on the face, and you can fold it right up out of the way for easy access to the cab area. You got cup holders, storage, glove compartment, Nice large touch screen uh, for your stereo. You've got your AC controls, charging port. You've got mirror, lighting area. Uh, down low, you got the emergency start. As you walk in, overhead, you've got a storage area, your cable hookup, control panel, control your slide, your generator, check your holding tanks. We got tank heaters on this and your water pump. Down low, you got your solar controller. Uh, your jacks are electric, battery disconnect, and lights and power, the heat duct. You got a countertop extension here. Nice large stainless steel sink with this cover, extended spray head. Your range is a three burner range with LED lights and oven lights. Down low, you got a nice drawer, good storage throughout. Remotes, you got your glass there for your microwave. Overhead. And then adjustable shelves. Underneath you got lights. We mentioned the power. Exhaust for your range and you got a light. Does exhaust outside. Booth dinette. You got drawers, seat belts on both sides of the dinette. Uh, your dream dinette just dropped down. We'll take a look at that made into a bed. All right, flipping up the cushions, you see you got Velcro there. And on this dinette, you got a lever that unlocks it, drops it down in the down position. There's that safety tether for the child safety seat. And then you can put the cushions in place 
using these backs utilizing that velcro which you can hear will hold the big ones in place and there's the dinette in the down position ready to sleep and it's just as easy setting it back up got your receptacles lights speakers shocks that hold up your cabinets you got your blinds and all your windows open Uh, safety tether for your child seat if you need it sticking with the kitchen area nice deep pantry and you got a 12 volt refrigerator freezer wardrobe nice storage there's that detachable ladder that will hook right on to the front of the bunk hanging storage drawers and deep storage down low with a little trash can. Queen walk around bed, you got a spot there for a TV, vent, your thermostat, large window in the back with the shade, and a shade and window there with a little cubby hole for storage, charging ports, overhead storage and lights. Again, AC ducts and a privacy curtain that closes off the bedroom from everything else. And with the curtain closed, you can still make it into the bathroom, no problem. Nice shower with the overhead skylight. I'm six foot five. I'm right up inside the skylight. I actually got a couple more inches if you need it. Close off the shower, storage, medicine cabinet, exhaust fan in the ceiling. You do have a heat duct in the bathroom. You do have an AC duct. Towel bars throughout. And that curtain will strap right here out of your way. Your brand new 2024 Thor Chateau 24F. We'll work our way outside. Take a look out there. All right, moving to the outside, you see the nice front cap with the Chateau logo, your Ford E350 Super Duty. Extended mirrors. You've got your tankless water heater. I got the slide in so we can look at all the compartments, but you do have a slide topper over your slide out. You go down low here. We've got your 4000 generator. Got the flex power there. Outside shower with hot and cold, your water connection. LP. We are looking at a 30 amp service cable hookup. Your large storage area here. There's your power cord, fuel, and your black tank flush. Got a factory installed ladder. We'll take a look at the roof. All right, you got some roof vents, your TV antenna, more roof vents, skylight. You are prepped for solar, nice clean fiberglass roof backup camera got a receiver on the back already set up with the seven pin for 5,000 pound towing you've got your stabilizer jacks here which you've got the manual or electric motor for those either or your campsite you got the full-length power awning with LED lights Another storage area with a drain, with a light. Back side of your furnace. We're looking at the hand cooked tires uh, on this 16 inch. Another little storage bin with a light. And you got outside TV. 
receptacle, fresh water fill, your brand new 2024 Thor Chateau 24F. Remember, if you're coming out to the lot to see this or any other camper in person, make sure you ask for Scott. All right, as you can see with the slide in, the bed folds, you got access to get into the bathroom, no problem. You still got access to the fridge, pantry, oven, dinette if you want to sleep or if you want it up, you can sit and you can still get in and out of the cab area pretty easily.